Welcome, dear viewers, to today's riveting analysis of the Women's 100 Meter Hurdles event, a roller coaster of unexpected twists and electrifying triumphs. In the realm of track and field, the only constant is unpredictability, a truth showcased vividly in the surprising outcome of the Women's 100 Meter Hurdles race. The spotlight was aimed elsewhere, far from the Jamaican contender, Daniel Williams. The prevailing attention rested upon the esteemed names of Toby Amusin, Jasmine Camacho Quinn, Kendra Harrison, and Nia Ali, the front runners for the coveted goal. Yet, as we know in this event, fate favors no one, and the hurdles serve as a potent reminder of this truth. The unforgiving hurdles can swiftly shift an athlete's fortune as exemplified by Nia Ali's unfortunate encounter with three of them, rendering her aspirations dashed. However, it was the seasoned Jamaican Daniel Williams who exhibited an exemplary performance from starting blocks to the finish line. Executing a flawless start, Williams harnessed her momentum and tapped into her exceptional top end speed securing an unforeseen victory on the grand stage in Budapest. The 30-year-old athlete, once triumphant in Beijing 2015, reclaimed her title with astonishing composure, clocking in at 12.43 seconds. In a photo finish showdown that left spectators in awe, Williams eclipsed the reigning Olympic champion, Jasmine Camacho Quinn of Puerto Rico, who cruised the line at 12.44 seconds. Kendra Harrison of the United States secured the bronze with a time of 12.46 seconds, an achievement that stands testament to her consistent excellence. In an event brimming with anticipation, Williams unleashed an awe-inspiring surge within the final 30 meters, propelling herself past her competitors, including the reigning Olympic champion in a heart-stopping crescendo that had fans holding their breath. With an unyielding determination and unmatched speed, Williams demonstrated her impeccable timing and sheer resolve, clinching victory by the slimmest of margins, a mere 0.01 seconds. Executing her strategy from the less favored lane two, Williams navigated the final hurdle shoulder to shoulder with Camacho, Quinn and Arison. In the ultimate stretch, she unherded a reservoir of strength, surpassing her adversaries and seizing the crown. For Camacho Quinn, a step higher on the podium marked an improvement from the previous year, a testament to her progress. In contrast, Harrison, the former world record holder, found herself grappling with final disappointment yet again, adding a bronze to her collection of Olympic and world silvers. In this arena of uncertainties, today's showdown epitomized the essence of track and field where the underdog can defy expectations and established champions can falter under the pressure. As we reflect on William's triumphant journey, let it stand as a testament to the spirit of athleticism, the pursuit of excellence, and the indomitable will to triumph against all odds. Thanks for tuning in. If you're new here, feel free to subscribe to the channel. For my returning subscribers, thanks for your support. And of course, if you like the video, give it a thumbs up and don't forget to hit the notification bell if you want to stay in the loop as it relates to what's happening in the track and field world. And of course, I'd love to hear from you. So don't be afraid to share your views down there in the comment section. And as always, keep the sports spirit alive.
Thank you.